Working on myself, working on my health, working on my mind Taking all the time, yeah, that I need just to find me Cause who's gonna do it for me? What's up, what's up, what's up? Welcome back to my channel It is Friday Um, I didn't go with Ash Um God literally told me to sit down, finish working on my website, and then I also feel like I need to like spend the day with him because baby, we need to talk. It's the seventh, and rent needs to be due. And so, you know, I just decided to stay. Well, he told me to stay in, and so I'm just here trying to get things done, trying to make sure my website is good to go. So, I'm shop not available. Okay, they want me to un, um, take out my password, but I don't want to take out my password shit. Um, but anyways, y'all, I'm just about to eat the rest of my Chipotle from yesterday that Ash brought. And, um, and finish working on my website. I just wanted to come and check in and see what every, not see what everybody was up to. And just give y'all an update. Let me focus and I'll be back. Peace. Yeah, it is so hot out here in Texas. Jesus, I got in my glasses fogged up. I keep, I didn't get no gas, so I gotta get gas. Um, I need to buy groceries. Ain't nothing in the house. I'm about to go to Chick Fil A. Um, I got me a free sandwich in the app. So I'm just about to use that. And I'm gonna get gas on the way. Lord, please let the traffic not be too bad. So I can get some gas. And then we're gonna come into the house because I got a package. My poly Miller's came in, so. Yeah. I'll see y'all when I see y'all. Peace. Now, this is what you call a lot of pickles. Now, Chick-fil-A. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is hilarious to me. Next time I won't just say a lot. I'll actually give a number because what? That is crazy. Wow. <sighs> Anyways. Anyways, I am home. Um I'm about to eat and then finish my website. It's working, working, working day night earlier. Um, I was trying to spend time with God, and he literally gave me a scripture, be still and know. And y'all, I rested in him for like four hours. I woke up, and I'm so good now. So, yeah, I'm about to get to work after I get done eating. So, I'll check in with y'all whenever. What's up, y'all? What's up? So I just wanted to come in, record a voice note, well, voice over for this portion of the video, um, because I just wanted to talk about a little bit about my last clip where I was saying how God told me not to go out and he told me to stay home. And um, when he told me that, I just knew that mean I was going to be in the house worshiping, praying, tearing, you know, fighting in the spirit, doing all these different things. Like I just knew I was about to have to go to war, okay? Um, because I had been seeking God. I had been pleading with God. I had I felt like I needed to petition. I felt like I needed to show him that I was worthy enough for an answer. I felt like I needed to perform for him in order for him to say, you know, good job and for, in order for him to show up and for him to quote unquote reward me. I thought I had to put on, I thought I had to do extra. I thought I had to catch his attention. I thought I had to do all of these things for him to be God and for him to show up and be the God that he is is Jehovah Jireh for him to be Jehovah Shalom because I needed peace. I needed peace in my mind. I needed peace in my heart. So I needed these things from God. And so I felt like I had to overly do something for him to show up for me. Um, but literally, so I sat in the house 
And I'm just like, um, after she left, I sat in the house and I'm like, so God, what do you want from me? What do you want to talk about? And that's when he had said to me, um, he gave me Psalms 46.10 and he said, just be still and know that I am God. So I'm like, okay, I don't know what to do with this. So literally I just opened my Bible. I put it on Psalms 46. I set my Bible beside me and I literally just sat there. No phone, no music, no nothing. Like literally just sat there and I'm like, okay, so I'm just waiting. I ended up falling asleep. I literally slept for four and a half hours. I had sweet sleep. Mind you, prior to this, I hadn't been getting any good sleep because I had been being tormented in my mind. I had been telling myself that you're going to get evicted. I had been telling myself that you're not going to launch this business. I had been telling myself all of these different things. I had been speaking death over different situations in my life. And then I also allowed the enemy to play with my emotions and my feelings. So... I was no longer taking every thought captive, but I was literally meditating on the thoughts. And so I was being mentally tormented to where I had absolutely no peace, no peace at all. And so in that sleep, when I woke up that morning, when I woke up that afternoon from that sleep, I realized I'm like, wow, I am. Um, I said, wow, I feel well rested. I feel like I had great sleep. I had a peace of mind. I had this knowing in my spirit that everything is going to be all right. And so when I um when I was just editing the video, I was like, I want to talk to them. I just need to encourage somebody. Because I think oftentimes we feel as though um, we need to do so much for God. Like we have to, you know, um, we need to fast. We need to pray. We need to worship. We need to tear. We need to do all of these things. Um, and yes, these things are good, but we don't have to do them for God to be God in our life. Um, and so I just wanted to encourage somebody and saying, maybe in this season, God isn't asking you to fight. Maybe he isn't asking you to tarry, but he's asking you to rest. I think it's oftentimes we forget that when we rest in God, um, that's when he can, that's when we literally cast our cares onto him. And that's when he literally takes all of the things that we are trying to do, like we're trying to hold on to. That's when we, he literally takes it off our shoulders and he does it for us. Um, I think we just get so afraid to like rest in God because when we rest in him, we're no longer in control. But in this season of life, you need to give it to God. Let him be in control. Like we need to stop trying to play God and let God be God because you can never do what God does. You can never show up the way God can. You can never do the miraculous the way that God does the miraculous. Yes, God has given you the ability and the power to do amazing things, but you cannot be God no matter what you do. Um, That's that's one person that you can never compete you can never compare because he is just he is just God and so maybe in this season God doesn't want you doing all of that he wants you to rest in him because um, when you're constantly doing, when you're constantly trying to be, um, you can't hear him. You're clouded by your own thoughts. You're clouded by opinions of people. You're cloud, like your judgment is clouded. So many things is going on that you can't even hear from him. And sometimes your healing, your deliverance, your answer, your confirmation may just simply be in resting in him. So I just want to encourage somebody in this season, you know, take it back to God and ask him, what does he want from you? But just ask him like, God, is this a season where you need me to rest? Is this a season where you need me to sit down? Is this a season where I need to like literally lay at your feet and do absolutely nothing else? Like sometimes we be, we sign ourselves up for warfare that God didn't even um, want us to go through in this season of life. I remember one time I was literally fasting and fasting and fasting and fasting and I felt like all hell was breaking loose and I'm just like God what is going on like but it wasn't I didn't feel like it was um I can't think of the word but you know how like you can tell when like you bringing something upon yourself like when all hell breaking loose and you know that it's not the enemy but it's you like you're the one that's disrupting your own peace and so I knew it was like that and I'm like God what is going on and God was like because you're on a fast that I never called you to your spirit man wasn't prepared for what was coming with this fast that's why I didn't call you to it so just see what God and ask him what does he want you to do in this season because for me my peace of mind, my clarity, my healing of the mind, my healing of the uh, heart, it was found in resting in him. So I just want to encourage you to rest and let God be God because at the end of the day, he got you. Okay. Stop trying to play God and let God be God. All right. Peace.
Make it look all nice. Can y'all see that? Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for loving me so. For loving me. Okay, now back to what I was doing. I've been screen recording this whole time. I don't think so. Y'all, we got our first order. Oh my gosh. Let me make sure I upload it to TikTok. Yeah. I cannot believe this. Oh my gosh. And my first customer, she gonna get two shirts. Because she was the first one. So I'm gonna send her some extra. Yeah, oh my gosh, this feels so surreal. Everything moving slow. <laughs> Normally my internet is not bad. Everything is moving slow this morning. It's like, why y'all playing with me? Why? Why? Literally, I'm st this thing is still trying to load. Stop. I can't believe we got our first water up like. <laughs> okay, let's see. View customer. Um, she just, she texted me and said she needs to get it. Her address, many address. Oh my gosh, it's my grill, S-H-E-R-I-E, -E. make sure I spelled it right, S-E-S-H-E-R-I-E, -E. thank you sis, okay. Mm -hmm. 
Because I first ordered them. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Whew. Okay. Alright y'all, that's all I wanted to do. I just wanted to come on here so y'all can see. I need to make me an official um, signature. Okay, let's verify that that's correct. Hey, 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 hey. We got our first order for a necklace. Baby, y'all better stop playing. Hey, y'all better stop playing. Oh, let me make this live on my Facebook pages. Switch over. Switch over. And then. And this is so much. This is so much. Let's share this to my actual profile. No, I I've been in here. Time. I'm like, I want to scream, but Ashes sleep. <laughs> What's going on? Oh, I got my first two orders. <laughs> yes. Girl. Yes. I just been over here trying to take it all in. I heard, well, I like literally heard you. I'm like, maybe she's praying. So maybe I should wait. <laughs> No, nah, baby, I did a lot of prayer. Like, I got when I say I've been over here talking to God, all this hurt. I don't even think I really like I slept. Uh -huh. But then I was like, okay, I was up at seven o'clock. I beat my alarm. You know how like when you when you ready for school, yeah. and you got your school clothes yeah. on the other side yeah. of the bed. Yeah. I feel like that's how I've been feeling. Like as as much as I was dreading this day, uh -huh. now I'm just like, wow, it's actually here. It's actually it's, here. Oh, see, come look at my website. You ain't gotta be on. You ain't gotta be on the thing. You never got to see the full thing. Okay, hold on. So this is my actual website. Yes. So let's go to the first page. So this is the home page. Yeah. And then it's a slash. I don't know why it's not sliding, but <laughs> I'm gonna show you. <laughs> so this is this. Oh my god. Then we got our scripture, and then it's like our welcome. Hi. This is so beautiful. And then these are like the top three shirts that I feel like people is going to gravitate to. Yeah. So I put these right here. Um, My Instagram stuff. So subscribe yeah. here. But 10 <laughs> <laughs> And then we got our products. Period. Yeah. yeah. So we got our product page and now about. Okay. Mm -hmm. Our about us page. Wow. You really did this. Thank like. you. And then we got a prayer request page. Wow, Key. Yeah. Oh, this is my website. Because we're not only just celebrating, we're celebrating this. Oh my we're gosh. celebrating this. Like, are you serious? I cannot believe it. I'm just like, oh my gosh. You should finally breathe. I know, for real. I'm sleeping real good tonight. <laughs> Do you hear me? I'm like, I think the hardest part was like getting this done. Mm -hmm. And now that the website is done, it's just like, okay, I can fulfill mm -hmm. orders. Yeah. I can fulfill yeah. orders. Yeah. But creating this, because I feel like this is like the first thing they see. Mm -hmm. So it's just like, you want this to look, you know, yeah. girl. Oh my gosh. When I say this, God has been on one already this morning. I've just been so, I just been, I'm going to tell you more about it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I can actually. So yeah, I am in the car headed to Dollar General because I need paper towels and stuff. And um, yeah, and y'all know Saturdays, if you don't know. Saturdays, Dollar General be having that all they deals and all they sales. Yeah, I'm that type of grown, which y'all should know by now. Um, but I just got done screaming, I'm an entrepreneur! Y'all, it feels so good. Like, 
oh my gosh and it's just day one i know that like it's so much like i know that god is going to do so much in his business and just like to see the love and support on day one i'm a, i'm not gonna hold y'all even the um i've gotten i think seven orders already and it's just like wow people really like god has really laid it on the heart of man to support me and that just like blows my mind um but i just wanted to come on here and just let y'all know what was going on when i get back to the house we're gonna actually start getting ready because we thought the place was over here on our side of town but it's actually towards tasha side of town so it's like an hour away um and so we have to get dressed and stuff so that we can get over there but i just need to come and grab and pick up a few things i hope this and not too loud but baby it's too hot to not have air on um but yeah we about to just run the dollar general pick up this stuff and then we're going back to the house and we get in ready it is so hot outside i don't know what i'm wearing um but we shall see we we're gonna see okay i don't know this is green if i feel like it's washing me away like this is definitely not my color like it's just not doing it for the girl right now but anyways i'm a pin curl or put some up put my flexor rods back in when i get to the house because i don't want my curls to fall uh but i just wanted to come and update y'all we launched we launched and we got us a couple of orders or whatever and yeah i'm excited i'm super i'm super excited <sighs> all right i'll check back in with y'all in a minute Oof. all right y'all we are getting ready to go to the um Kind of making class. I don't know how time caught up. Caught up with us. I'm so glad they didn't get on my shirt. Do I wonder what else I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do all this stuff. But um, I don't know how time got away from us. So yeah, yeah. I know. I just put on foundation to blend in. I don't put on full face dang I forgot to do my contacts <laughs> somebody want to do like a FaceTime with me and teach me how to make do my makeup Don't always speak at once. I really want to learn before the year is over. I really want to learn before my birthday. So I can beat my face. Let's put my contacts in here. Now that I just got makeup on the paper towel. Don't need brown stuff on nothing in the bathroom, okay? take these today. I forgot to take them back tonight, so I'm going to take them now. for me to switch them out and get another pair but that won't be today what am i doing what am i doing what am i doing what am i doing um okay let me just put my hair thank you i need my hot comb so my hair This is 
Oh, being a woman is so much. It's so much. Hopefully my hot comb don't burn. Sometimes it just be. Oh, I look washed out on this camera. Whatever. My makeup do not look like it gone. Bring it to me, I don't care what they say. Cause this ain't it. I was so wrong when I made my pick. Better red chair, so I thought he would leave me. She ain't even ready to get me that I quit. Oh, bring it to me, I know you will. Yeah, I surrender my will. You said a man find a good thing when he find her. So, Lord, I'm trusting you. I'm on my search. This ain't the one, but I know she out there. Should've broken off way sooner. I was unsure, but I know that's unfair. I thought you had a heart for the God I love. That's just unclear. So, I can't. Yes, I regret it. I'm telling you so. Not letting you know. This thing's not working. We're unequally equal. Alright, let me hurry up. I feel like the pressure is getting grosser. Time went by too fast. No, literally. Jesus. It's like when the clock strike four, it was over with. I need to see, to see you're not the one for me I don't mind waiting for the one that leads me To the feet of Jesus I don't mind praying for the one oh. So I know you're out there And it's my prayer That you'll find me And that's on me Yeah, I'm trying to this is me. This is real life right now because I'm running Behind so I'm mixing this X bar vanilla with this Amber from Ulta. I think that's where I got it from Yeah, I'm mixing them two together it smells real good. Oh I'm not getting out the car for that you never get going on. I'm trying to switch purses. I need my rings. Okay, try off the camera. Phone. Need this, need this. Got it. Yeah. I didn't drop stuff. Had to get out the car. Oh, Lord. It's giving. I should have got started at 12. <laughs> like how? I'm 
shades on. <laughs> the birthday girl should be a passenger princess because somebody got all these dang on toll things. Get that in a timely manner. In Jesus' name. No. And I started to just bring that edge because mine look like it's already trying to curl up. This is one rod on the side of my head for me. We have made it to the place. What? Mm. Oh, look at she knew. She said no copyright strikes over here. Okay. You hit that thing quick. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be quicker than that. She know what I'm talking about. Help your friend get them coins. Okay, period. <laughs> period. Oh. Um. Oh, Oh I brought one. Brought two different kinds. Oh, she got two kinds. Two big vests, so I can actually see them. Sitting there, a little picture of me. I'm not gonna play with you. Yeah. Once I cover myself up, don't need my goodies out. My goodies. My goodies. My goodies. My pants is all the way up here. He's giving, he has risen. Like, come on. I'm not even gonna play with you. At all. You smell good. Thank you. Mmm. Smell like crack cocaine. Not crack cocaine. Come on, bro. Keep your back there. Okay. It's like I can fake the way I put this thing right here. What about the cord and stuff? If it's in the Okay. Well, They'll be all right. No, ma'am. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, Tosh. Hi. You're getting so cute. Thank okay, you. getting closer so I can get it in my video. Okay, great. <laughs> Hi, Kiki. Hey, boo. Do you love me? Okay. Are you writing? What 
Mama Yeah, let me see what it is. It. And that's King Zoo. You see her? In the hill. Right, right. <laughs> okay, ready? Mm -hmm. Hi! I'm the gang, oh, I'm the mom. Somebody finally decided to come back home. Mm -hmm. Hey, girl. Hi, girl. Everybody's just listening in. Oh. Is that Leah No, she not. Tasha, did you not see us beside you? I got video of you. What? You. <laughs> we blew the horn at you and everything. Jesus? You. I was Jesus. This is exactly how you was. <laughs> I said, do she not hear us? No. I said, now nah, she needs to pay attention. We don't know. No, no. Do it again. So he said, they saw me driving. This is how you. Were. And then you start texting on their phone. And I said, actually, she texted me, and then I look at my phone. I said, oh, she's texting me. <laughs> <laughs> I got a video. No, did I put that up? I I'm gonna please do it again. So Keith said, they saw me driving. This is how you want. And I then was you start texting on their phone. <laughs> and I said, actually, she texted me, and then I look at my phone. I said, oh, she's texting me. <laughs> I got a video. No, do not put that up. I will sue you. you. I will. I will definitely sue you okay, for. <laughs> Be on the internet. Tasha. Now she won't be on the camera. <laughs> Around the globe. 
That's just my little intro, so now we're going to jump into the main part of the class. We're going to start by talking about Candle Making 101. Are you all ready? Yeah. Yes. Yeah? Awesome. Cool. So, Candle Making 101. There are three main ingredients to a candle, and I'm going to elaborate on that in a second, but I'm going to start off with a pop quiz. I'm going to let y'all shout out, what do you think the three main ingredients of a candle are? Don't be shy. Wax. Wax. Wick. 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 And I heard scent. Yeah. yeah. Fragrance. So, wax, wick, and fragrance. That was quick. Oh, good. Okay. Down the wick a lot slower than say like a birthday cake candle that has just one string. You light that on your birthday cake, you sing happy birthday, and within that time your candle is gone, right? These wicks are going to give your flame a lot longer of a burn as it works its way down the grade. Yes, honey. You got a day? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, y'all. So as you finish up prepping your vessels, I'm just gonna get them. Get them. I'm just trying to use them and them. Strawberry shortcake gonna do it for me every time. Maybe that was the temperature food and now I'm going to drift it away. Come on, how can I take it? Mm. 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 You better talk to the camera. Mm. 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 <laughs> oh no, man. <laughs> Lisa, Lisa knows if she gave me this face off of the other one for finally smelling early. <laughs> Let's go back to uh, the drawing board. Mm -hmm. I feel so old. It's like so much. I don't know what it is. Because I don't know what I'm like. You know? I'm going over there. It's a little stressful, you know? <laughs> <laughs> So many options. You got a cherry, boo. You don't like the cherry? No. You gonna leave it with that? How about this? Okay. I feel like this would be something good to walk into the house in. So this is our first run of up. Okay. When you get done with the strawberry guava, that's my top one right now. So, so far, these two. Oh, 
don't forget to get you some little footy here, no boo. These two are like the first one in the club. This is apple harvest, apple harvest, and strawberry wow. These are the. <laughs> These are my two runners. So, okay, apple harvest and strawberry wallace. Like, I think. <laughs> you found anything you like here, Tom? It's a dead space over there for me. This look like she going through it. <laughs> Y'all, we over here doing not Diddy Bob. Smell this one too. You on the wrong side, eh? Oh no, it's the other side. I think that's some Strawberry guava and apple harvest. Okay, so now I don't know if I'm ready, but we're gonna act like we're ready and we're gonna do this. Okay? Said her time, honey. She said she did not come to play. And we meet. And we meet. No, for real. I feel like 
because it's fruity, it's summery. Mm -hmm. I feel like we're going like, you know like when you're sitting outside and you have like little We are officially Chandler's, okay? Period. Period. What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? What's up? It is Sunday, and at first, I don't know. It was like we was out all night. Like, everybody was tired. We didn't get up to roughly around 940. Um, and then at first, we was just going to watch um, service online. But the Holy Spirit was Holy Spirit. And he was like, no, y'all are going to church. So we got up and we was running around like Speedy Gonzalez is and trying to get it together. And we are at the church. I just parked. Tasha and Ash went to get in line. Dez overslept. Arlena is here. So, you know, we just, we here. Um, we here. We, we made it. Um, but I just wanted to come and check in, start off today's vlog and say, what's up, what's up, what's up? And I'll see y'all at the church. God uses uncertainty as a workout regimen for your faith. You don't think that Daniel's uncertainty was high as he was being led towards a lion's den, hearing Scar arr, growl in there and Mufasa. And sit. Like, I don't think they were just chilling. You just imagine you're walking and you hear some lions. You don't think uncertainty was high? But watch it. Uncertainty is the workout regimen for your faith. So let me put it this way. Constant certainty is to keep your faith out of shape. Talk Holy Spirit. I don't know where we're going. I don't know where the building is. But I'm going to keep on decreeing. I'm going to keep on praying. God, show us your will. I am uncertain. But I'm like, oh God, I see what you're doing. Because uncertainty is your methodology of growing my faith. Okay, I'm going to work out my faith when I don't know what's going to happen right now. Yeah. Yeah. Uncertainty, uncertainty, uncertainty. This is for those whose mind has a death grip, death grip on the hypothetical, but then a loose grip on God's historical. I've tried to teach us, especially on Therapy Thursday, how to fight to renew your mind. I said, okay, listen, there are too many scriptures that teach us how you fight hypothetical is you use God's historical. You think about what God has done before more than you're thinking about what your fear of encountering. Because truth be told, the fear of what you fear is greater than the fear of what's going to happen in itself. The fear that you have of this happening is greater than it actually happening. So you're allowing the spirit of fear, fear to be your therapist. And you have to book a session with the spirit of fear before you obey. You fight by using God's historical. Why do you think all throughout the fabric of scripture you keep hearing this language? Remember. Ashes look more uh, YouTube worthy. What's up, y'all? We are out of church. Um, we want to grab some food. Ash and um, Tasha ran inside of ran inside of Target. I'm just sitting in the car. I don't feel like going in. I feel like I have an attitude. I feel like my I feel like uh, attitude is trying to creep in. I feel like I'm trying to get annoyed. I feel like I'm trying to get frustrated. Um, and it's not with nobody. It's just like thinking about the circumstance and the situation and stuff. Um, like, yeah. So I'm just taking this moment to like sit in the car, sit with myself, let out my feelings. And yeah, so I just wanted to come and check in. I'm just gonna take a moment to like feel the feels. <laughs> and then, um, yeah what's up y'all i am in the bed like i'm beat down i don't want to do nothing 
and Shantasha is in the living room. It's Sunday, and y'all know normally I kiki, chill, and laugh and do all the things, but yeah, I'm just not in the mood, so I'm just laying in the bed. Um, I want to take a nap, but I know it's too late to take a nap, so I just exported all my footage to my computer while I, um, while I just rest. <sighs> but that's really, that's really all, like, yeah, <laughs> that's really all. I'm really, I'm really tired. Um, so I'm just resting. I just wanted to come and check in. I had to turn my TV on and turned it right back off. I'm like, I just don't want to consume anything right now. I just want to relax. And so that's what I'm doing. I'm just laying in the bed, rubbing my feet together, chilling. You know what I mean? So if I do anything, I'll pick the camera back up. But if I don't, mm, we'll just come in and off this vlog. But now, my sis said I look good the entire vlog last week. And now I come on here looking um, busty, rusty, and disgusting. Mm, 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 mm. Catch me next week. I'll do better. <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm going to see y'all later. Oh, so, we are back in Key's house. And Ashley is over here being my barista. Never mind that. Why is she coming here with this recycle cup? Oh, um, listen, reduce, reuse, recycle. Um, I'm going to feel like I'm in a coffee shop, okay? But the sis over here really grabbing ice like she work at the coffee shop. Is there any other way? <laughs> I really appreciate it. So, um, ooh, child. It's giving rough right now. Okay, keep going. We, we going to get her in action. So what do we have today? What are we making? We're having a classic <laughs> vanilla chai latte. Oh, I love vanilla. So. Is this like coffee? coffee? It's not coffee. Okay. It's just tea, but it does have some caffeine in there. Okay. So, uh, you know. Okay, have you already know? Okay. I guess, you know. Oh, she's putting that splash. A vanilla. Okay. Oh, she's now. <laughs> I don't be doing all this. Okay. All right. And what else? You're going to take some milk. Okay. Almond milk to be exact. Vanilla. Okay. I like mine. It's creamy. Okay. Thank you. Then pull the cream up. Tasha, send me the clip. <laughs> I, I know. I'm. <laughs> drop shoot it to, not drop shoot. Girl, go to bed. Air, <laughs> that's why I want to be. Air drop it to me. Uh, okay, she got a metal straw and everything. So that's Key's cup right there. That look good. Let me come and try it. Ooh, Let me be <laughs> Give your honest review, child. The fun our boy. It's a coffee sh cup for me. Right. It is mine right there. Okay, this needs a little bit of mixing. Okay. Blue leaves. Just wait until you get like skinny like your man. Uh, like he's man. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. Okay. Hello. <laughs> Uh, what can you wait for me? Oh, <laughs> down goes Frasier. <laughs> it's not Frasier. Wait. I don't know why it's so zoomed. Whatever. I think we're good. I guess we got a squad. Oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Alright, y'all. We're gonna we gonna try. Mm -hmm. A chai tea gonna do it every time. Every time. This is good. That little a vanilla. Yeah. yeah. It's very much creamy. It's sweet but not OD, you know? I give this a cute 8.59. Okay. And okay. I give you a 10 out of 10. How oh, do you okay. Not everybody can be perfect, so I was trying to oh. be no, no, no. I was trying to be realistic, but then it's a 10. As okay. a friend, it's a 10. 
Okay. <laughs> but in the real world, 8.5. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Can I get an answer? Cheers, y'all. Yeah. Thank you. Hopefully this will get me through editing. Get you a friend that makes you chai tea. What's up y'all, what's up? So we have made it to the end of the vlog and I am just here to close it out. I am up editing, it's 11 o'clock at night and this is the last clip. Um, I didn't really do anything today. We went to church, went out to eat, came to the house. I spent most of my time in the room, started editing my laptop, started just being stupid so i came to my desktop and so i'm in here editing tasha is back there editing um ash is in the bed we got our make belief i don't know what this is right here um but uh yeah so i just wanted to come and close out the vlog and we will try again tomorrow hopefully you enjoyed all of the clips at the i was about to say coffee shop again all of the clips from the candle making class um it was so much trying to edit it was giving i need an editor because i don't know how to make it flow and so yeah i did the best i could so i hope you enjoyed it okay um trying to see if there's anything else don't forget to go and shop 818 okay 818 yeah 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 um, yeah, go and shop at 18. Anything else? Do I got anything else to say? I think that's it, y'all. Um, I'm gonna leave it in the description box. Also, my website is back up and running. So, if you want a journal, you can go to thegeekatrail.com and get you a journal. Yeah, baby, I'm plugging everything. Go swipe the carrots. Go and swipe the carrots. I'm over here charging Tasha for electricity and water to wash her face. <laughs> <laughs> Are you charging me? Oh, so you gotta try. I'm charging for you to sleep over tonight. So, what about that? How about we're just swapping? Uh uh. See, you talk about that big noise. Uh huh, yeah. Uh huh. People want to talk out of noise, okay? But no, y'all. Um, we're about to just finish editing and then wrap it on up because we got a busy day tomorrow because somebody has stuff to do, okay? My sis gonna tell y'all what's coming on like very, very soon. I was about to say later, but baby, she ain't got she ain't got time to be waiting any later. <laughs> she need to make the announcement like yesterday. So, uh, wait, you posted it on your uh, YouTube, Instagram, right? Okay, well, I guess she'll just have to tell y'all when she's ready to tell y'all. I thought maybe, yeah. Um, but anyways, y'all, that's all. I'm not going to drag this clip because y'all know one thing I will do is talk, okay? So we're not going to do that. Uh, <laughs> but don't forget, you are called, you are chosen, and you are loved. I love you, but Jesus loves you more. Until the next time. Peace. Yeah, yeah so we supposed to be going to bed. And I was sending Tasha a picture. <laughs> I'm sending Tasha a picture. <laughs> I'm sending Tasha the picture from uh, the pictures that the lady had took for us at the place. And I told Tasha, I said, Tasha, they all ugly. They, and then oh. look at how they look. <laughs> <laughs> it's giving. It's giving one of those. <laughs> they look so long. <laughs> Y'all, yeah. Yeah. Can they can't hear you back there. <coughs> I'm gonna show them the picture of Lassiana Boulevard. Y'all, that is a mess. That girl was so. I don't know how she took them pictures, but all of us look swole. <laughs> Do you ever laugh so hard your head? <laughs> That's what her key was giving. Yeah, oh my gosh. Okay, bro, for real. We about to go to bed. No, we not about to go to bed. I'm about to go to bed. Yeah, we about to go to bed. But that was just so funny. I don't know what that woman had did to them pictures, but baby. 
everybody from the knees down <laughs> looked like we had gout. <laughs> we looked swole. <laughs> and I didn't even notice Tasha's feet. Them things look long. <laughs> it's giving me the length of this tripod. <laughs> What are those? <laughs> Y'all, we didn't laugh so hard, but we gotta stop because Ash is in there going to sleep. She gotta go to work tomorrow. Okay, y'all, for real. That's the end of the vlog. Bye. <laughs> I'm seeing me through a different lens. I'm taking time to the work with them. I'm working on the enemy, the enemy. Been praying for my enemies, my enemies.